Tractors, as far as the eye can see, an increasingly familiar sight across Europe as farmers protest rising energy prices and stringent climate change regulations. Now hundreds of Czech farmers have driven their tractors into downtown Prague, blocking lanes of traffic. One farmer told Reuters, we came today mainly because of the bureaucracy around farming. The paperwork is on the edge of what is bearable. However, the Czech Republic's prime minister says protesters in Monday's demonstration had ulterior motives. He wrote on X, quote, Today's demonstration does not have much in common with the fight for better conditions for farmers. He added, We are negotiating with those who represent farmers and discussing what our agriculture needs are. ABC News reports major organizations representing Czech farmers did not participate and distance themselves from the rally after discovering some protesters were behind pro-Russian demonstrations. Some demonstrators called for the government's resignation. More Czech farming groups say they will join protests against EU policies on Thursday. They will be reportedly joined by farmers from nine other countries along border crossings. Similar protests have popped up in Germany, Italy, Slovakia, and Poland. The EU did make some concessions weeks ago, including scrapping plans to cut the use of pesticides and chemicals. Still, the protests seem to be spreading. Last month, French farmers demanding lower fuel prices, higher wages, and fewer regulations brought farm equipment to block major roadways outside of Paris. Farmers had particular resistance to the European Union's nature restoration law that says 4% of farmland must go unused. Farmers say the rule cuts into production and hurts their income. The law, which went into effect in 2023, is meant to combat climate change in an effort to preserve and restore habitats harmed by farming.